Howdy everyone, Pojo here with an Age of Magic video and in today's video we are going to be versing the new beasts with the Dark Prodigy team. I'm having so much fun with this team because it is doing pretty well. It's doing pretty well, however it does come with a little bit of RNG because of enemy fortifies. It doesn't always have a chance to work. However, in 20 battles, we 3 starred 85% of the time, we 2 starred 10% of the time and we did lose one battle. So a 5% loss ratio. And I'll explain why that happened in the battle. The way this battle can unfold, there can be several outcomes. It all depends on the start of the fight and you will see that. So we'll get into it. I'll do an initial play. I'll try and get the best possible outcome for you guys on video. And after that, after I, I've explained it, I'll do some silent fast runs through if you guys want to stick around and watch that. So let's get into it. I'll show you how to use Dark Prodigy. So going into battle, your Loki is going to start first because of Lael. Now that is super important because Loki gets to move before everyone else. No one's bar has started to fill at all. And this is giving you a huge advantage. And I stick by what I'm going to say next. Again, up to you how you want to do it. But I will always suggest Maelstrom of Death. The reason for this is because with a full Dark Elf team, excluding the enemy fortifying, you have a 100% chance to reduce the enemy speed. And that is so powerful because their initiative bars have not even started to increase yet. Which means you get a full turn on every single enemy to of reduced speed. It's a massive increase. What we're looking for here is four debuffs on the enemy rock after this ability. So we cast it. Four debuffs. He's got four debuffs. I know I'm going to one-shot him. Next, we're going to cast the Gaze of Ishtar. Gaze of Ishtar's debuffs are they can't be fortified so that's why i want four i know now he has seven debuffs and i can one shot the rock with the touch of his style takes him out beautiful huge advantage to us next up because the sooner has the reduced speed we get to move before her so i'm going to cast palsy on her and reduce her initiative to zero and we are going to hopefully you do have the chance to take her out at this point so actually we didn't do enough damage to her unfortunately so we actually let's have a look can we double strike here we can wasn't enough a little bit too okay the debuffs get removed we are going to use our counter attack here hopefully that's enough to take out the wukong or trigger the resurrect it should yep beautiful Actually, we can just take out Wukong. I am going to take him out because he does do a lot of damage. Wonderful. Can we take out Sooner as well? I'm just going to auto attack and save our ability. Beautiful. Wonderful. Like I said, this is almost a perfect setup for this fight. This is like the best outcome possible. Actually, it can be a little bit perfect. You do have the chance to take out Sooner in that rotation. I wasn't able to, unfortunately. We could take out Phoenix if we wanted to here. Actually, we will. There is a chance she'll resurrect and resurrect someone else. She doesn't. Beautiful. We're going to put the speed on four times and take out Pig Boy. And that's a three-star battle, full HP. At the start of the battle, however, there are just so many little things that can happen that can completely change how this battle plays out. Most of the time, you will win, though. Unfortunately, it's just not guaranteed. The biggest downfall to this team is if the enemy rock at the start fortifies the freeze or not the freeze sorry the speed decrease and then it's a bit of a struggle you can yeah it just a bit of an uphill battle most of the times you still can win you are going to maybe lose your drake worst case scenario you just lose the battle outright anyway ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for watching if you do have any questions feel free to leave a comment below i'll answer to the best of my ability and wherever you are in the world until next time take care of yourself like I said, there will be some more battles playing after this if you're keen to watch those and see how they play out. I'm not going to be talking in them, though. Up to you guys. All right, peace.